Sergio. Stop clowning on the these people playing. On the what you need to do is thank God City. for Black Lives Matter. Because if this had been be three Tijuana. years ago, you would have never been heard from again. Okay? Let's just let's just be honest, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna find out what happened to your mama. And then uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, stop whatever drugs you took. We're going to take it off the market. I'm from Chicago. My flight was Columbia. Why am I going to Tijuana? This is a kidnapping. They're in uniforms. Thank you for participating. I was going to Columbia. I'm from Chicago. I should not be going to Tijuana. <sighs> Let me go! This is kidnapping! Cameras, please! Kidnapping! Kidnapping! I wasn't going to Tijuana! I was going to Medellin in Chicago! What's up, you cool kids and cats? It's your girl! Loosen the speaks and I'm back with another review. Honey, let's talk about Sergio Brown. Listen, everybody is talking about it, and we are definitely going to talk about it. Aunties, aunties, uncles, where y'all at? Where you at? Raise your fist. Pump it up in the air. Didn't we talk about this at the uh, family reunion about uh, 20, 25, 30 years ago? Huh? Didn't we talk about that when we took prayer out? Huh? Eh? Didn't, didn't we talk about as the fabric of the family starts to decay, that we were going to start seeing this, huh? Mother against son, son against mother, daughter against mother, huh? And now as black peoples, now I don't know nothing about nobody else because I ain't been nobody else, but black. Y'all know this something we don't do. Y'all know this is something that we don't do, but yet we're seeing it every day. And then the more I see so many of you out here in the comment section, she must have did something to him. Blah, say blah. I don't know what happened. You don't know what happened, but I'm, in my opinion, this joker. Been acting a fool way before he into loom talking about fake news, okay? Because anytime you bringing up uh, uh, you quoting Donald Trump as an African American, huh, outside of the United States, something ain't right, uh huh, something ain't right, bruh, something ain't right. First of all, you look three, first of all, every picture I see of you, you look different. Stop cooking. Y'all, look, stop cooking your drugs on the stove, on your hot plate. It ain't working. You're changing your looks, your disposition, your countenance is off. We know what's going on. And a lot of you, you young folks, you can't take disappointment. When stuff goes on in your life, you just lose your freaking mind. We not made like this, people. We don't go killing off our folks. Yes. We have hard times. That's when, and listen, nine times out of ten, mama was saying some real things that he needed to hear, and it went left. Because, see, now you can't say nothing to him. If you don't agree with them and give them your money, they want to do all kind of stuff to you. You see it here on YouTube. When these crack babies come on here, because, you know, all these crack babies got uh channels now. Yes, especially in this sector. When you don't give them money, cash apps, and all that kind of stuff, it's okay to help people, okay? I promise you it's okay. But don't sit here and be no doggone fool. And when they get to acting crazy and they're too much, reach out. Here we have a woman that is gone. Where maybe someone could have helped her. Because I, at look, listen, in my opinion, I know, I know if he had those, if he was burning her, her clothes, first of all, mama, you don't touch nothing on mamas. 
Okay? You don't touch her clothes or nothing else. Okay? We don't do that. Y'all know that. You don't go in no black woman's uh, house and room and start touching her stuff. So when they said that he was burning her stuff, that right there, baby, <laughs> y'all ain't even got to have no trial. <laughs> okay? Everybody raised by a black woman, you already know something went down. We want to know what happened. We want to get into it. We want to know how this happened because we do not want this to continue. Disrespecting kids, disrespecting parents, just disrespect at all is an all time high in our community. And at some point, we're going to have to talk about it. You can call me anything you want to call me, but make sure you call me Miss Lucinda. OK, we're going to make sure we talk about this. We want to stay on top of these stories. Lots of content creators are talking about this and we all have different things to bring to the table. We'll talk about it later. Bye. He said he wasn't himself the past few months. He was out of his uh, out of his mind. The search for former NFL player Sergio Brown continues. Family members say they last heard from Brown and his mother Myrtle back on Thursday. Saturday, Myrtle's body, the mother, was recovered from a creek in suburban Maywood. They were taken out the trash and they seen him had a bonfire where he burnt all her clothes. Fake news. Fake news. Fake news. It has to be the FBI. They came into my house on Bob Marley's death day. 511 Asian gas unwarranted. They kidnapped me twice from home, the Maywood Police Department. I know right. mom fucking mama was on vacation in Sinaloa. That's fucking fake news. Get the fuck out my goddamn face. She retired. You wanna come to me?